be a woman in this society is to be looked at and unseen, each separate part parceled out and pinned for presentation, as if no one is whole, a collection of contorted instincts, an end goal. So often we forget this body is temporal, it will deteriorate far too fast, in fact, to spend lifetime tracking another's perfect state to locate where you're at. What sort of narration is that? When your rendition is based on external validation and someone else's opinion, their interpretation of you upon peering past the reflection, perception, you see through. It is not simply about the ill health inherent in perpetuating and unrealistic, idealistic images about the back-breaking weight of expectations like bricks stacked with each long look, each disrespect, the violence, the shame, the silence, attacks. We won't fight back. There is only fighting forward. Gaze trained on what we head toward, not on where we fell. I want to drop the weight of these worries which you sell to walk with head held high, eyes upright and wide. We do not have to hide. To look through windows rather than at our own reflection. To see inside where the question of what is beyond surpasses a passive superficial pursuit of the masses. Beauty in this culture is one of the most corrosively corrupted, destru destructive concepts I've encountered. It is an inert and dead me where your worth is in who is there to perceive you and what they've seen. Conversely and similarly, it seems, if you're a man, you're not really supposed to feel anything while still being responsive, heartfelt, and caring. I know many men whose inherited cultural projected impression is that any expression of their need will be seen as masculine, dominion, aggression, or greed. What happened? to the human being. There are good men, noosed by their ancestry, all strung up and numb, guilty until proven impotent for no good reason, and for some reason, I wonder where us want to equality. Separation is one of the best tools of disempowerment I've seen. Create each other a segregated thing. You know what I mean? It seems to read until I see behind the scenes. Cardboard cutouts, plastic sheets, motions moved by strings. Here's the thing. Our society is built on the back of one big batshit crazy automaton of a grandfather fucking turtle. We play pantheon to that patriarch. Like children make believe. And as in all of you cycles, pretend we cannot leave. So with teeth, grit, smiles, eyes, and rage, we stay upon this stage. Most of us learn at a very young age how to build a castle.